Hello everybody and welcome to a new video. My name is Senor and today I'm going to show you how to add mods in your Feedbeast 1.6.4 packs. So we're going to start from scratch and how to install Feedbeast itself and how to install the mods. So it's going to be really easy. Just make sure you put this video on full screen to see everything detailed. It's sometimes hard to see if you just watch it in normal view. So you want to go first go to the feedthebeast.com website. I will put all the links you need in the description. Okay, so when you are at the website, make, you're gonna scroll down and download the .x or the jar file. It doesn't really matter, but uh, I just prefer the .exe or also called executable because I just prefer it. So you want to click on download. I already got it, so I'm not gonna do it. But when you go download your Feed the Beast, make sure you make a folder on your desktop or whatever you want and um, call it Feed the Beast or something. Okay, when you did that, you're gonna drag the .x file of your Feed the Beast you just downloaded in there. Okay, so that's really important so that all the feed piece files stay together because you can see I already got some uh, few folders from feed to beast in that map and I didn't make them so all the game made it by itself and I don't like to get see those files on my desktop so that's why I got it in a folder so I should just doing that so when you got that you want to hit the launcher and click on run okay so if you're gonna do this for the first time it should say uh, it wants a destination where it's gonna place the folders. Make sure you place it in your folder then if you feed the beast. Okay, so now we got the launcher over here. Make sure you got the latest launcher to get the feed the beast packs. Okay. So at the moment there are only two 1.6.4 packs. That's the Die Wolf 20 that just came out today, and the Horizons that came out I think two days ago. And it works for both of them and all the packs that are going to come will also work like the same. So it's going to be really easy. So now we want to go make or find a mod you want to play. So I suggest go to Google and just type in Minecraft mods. And there will, you come on a few websites. So skydash.com is a really nice website if you just on install it in your minecraft but um because you get ex executable file to just run it and install but we don't want to do that so we're going for the website uh let's go for minecraft dl okay so uh, just choose whatever much you want and what when you download it you put it just on your desktop or whatever you want it and I download, downloaded my Darkcraft mod. I got it here. So it's a jar file. It can also be a WinRAR file if you can see here. It doesn't really matter which one. But it all works fine. Okay. Sorry, I have to unboost these. <laughs> okay. So we got the pack over here. I already installed it because I already played it, of course. But uh, you want to select the mod pack you want. I'll just go for Die Wolf 20 player and click on Edit Mod Pack, okay? So, what you're gonna do now is you're gonna click on Add Mod. Now, go to your desktop or whatever you place the folders in for your mods and you want to select those, okay? So, if you did, you're just gonna click on Open and it should come in this list, okay? But I already got them here but I got them disabled at the moment because I play on the server and you're not allowed to play on the server if you've got more mods installed than there's usual so that's why but I'm just gonna hit Darkcraft on enable okay just close this and now you wanna get hit the launch button now it's gonna for the first time if you use this download the mod pack can take a few minutes and then it's gonna launch your Minecraft 
feed the bees. Okay. So let's full screen this sucker up. Can take a few minutes to get this. But don't maybe sometimes gonna say it's not responding, but just just ignore it. It will be fine. So I'm gonna show you guys now in a second that Darkdraft is installed and works. Okay, it's still loading. There we go. It's not responding. But we just wait. Why did I even click on that? It doesn't matter, but we just have to wait. It doesn't take long. Don't mind all the red things over there. It's normal. Okay, so what I know, there's 102 mods loaded in default Vita Beast, okay, on this pack. But I got 100 Tigos. There's Darkcraft installed now. So we got a great a feed the beast world with colored bullshit. I'm sorry for my language. Let's just go for this. Let's just go for survival for now. So we can see that it's working. Okay, so it's loading up the world now. Building generation and such. That it needs to do. And it should come up in a second. There we go. Yes. Yep, there we go. Okay, so the first thing you notice on the left side, top right, no, top left corner, you see that, um, yeah, you can see it, but, or I can't, how can I say that? Um, it's on the left side, you see that green bar, that's from Darkcraft. That's the first thing you see it working but you want to go to the inventory of this and you want to go find for the this thing that's the dark craft mod so here you can find all the items from dark craft i think almost i didn't know if it acts always the same or not but yeah but you will see we got dark craft installed and it works so that's pretty much it about this video. So if you have any questions about mods or just questions about anything of Feed the Beast, please let me know. I will helpfully help. Oh wait, no, helpfully help you. <laughs> I like to help people with it. So yeah, thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed, please give the like and share it with your friends. So if they need help, they can see what they have to do. Also subscribe out to find out what happens next time. We will have soon, very soon, tomorrow, maybe maybe the next day, a Feed the Beast Let's Play series on my channel. And also some more awesome stuff going on. So I hope you enjoyed. Please give a like and share it with your friends for the second time. I always do it when I say something before we end. But that doesn't matter. But um, yeah. Have a nice one everybody. Bye.